Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here once again. As a kid, I remember magnets being the first thing that got me really excited about science that I realized was science. Like two pieces of metal that could stick to each other, but only in certain ways. If you put them the other way, they would repel each other. And they could stick to other metal, no matter which way you put them. But not every metal, just certain metals. And then I got a little book about electricity and magnetism. And I remember learning that you could take a piece of metal that wasn't a magnet and wrap some wire around it and put electricity through it, and it became a magnet. What magic was this? Uh, fast forward a few years, and I learned about magnetometers, how to be able to see that magnetism, its direction and its strength, all that cool stuff. Well, magnetometers are way more versatile than I ever could have imagined at that tender young age, and now we have a new one for you in a brand new form factor, introducing the new SparkFun Micro Magnetometer. The SparkFun Micro Magnetometer features the MMC 5983MA sensor, a fully integrated three-axis magnetic sensor with built-in supporting electronic circuits requiring fewer external components, making it perfect for our new Quick Micro form factor. Quick Micro is our smallest I2C supported board form factor yet. At only 0.75 by 0.3 inches, that's 24.65 millimeters by 7.62 millimeters for our metric friends, Quick Micro is perfect for projects and applications that have space or weight concerns. With just a single Quick connector, micro boards work great alongside the Quick multi-port or at the end of a Quick daisy chain. It can measure magnetic fields within the full scale range of 8 gauss with 0.25 milligauss or 0.0625 milligauss per LSB resolution at 16-bit or 18-bit operation mode and 0.4 milligauss total RMS noise level. If all of these letters and numbers don't mean anything to you, just know that it allows for directional accuracy of 0.5 degrees in electronic compass applications. It has a max data rate of 1000 Hz plus on-chip sensitivity compensation and on-chip temperature sensor. An integrated set reset function provides for the elimination of error due to null field output change with temperature and can be performed for each measurement, periodically, or when the temperature changes by a predetermined amount as the specific application requires. In addition, the set reset function clears the sensors of any residual magnetic polarization resulting from exposure to strong external magnets. All of this sits on one of our quick micro form factor boards, so at 0.75 inches by 0.3 inches, that's 24.65 millimeters by 7.62 millimeters for our metric friends, with a single quick connector on the board. With our Arduino libraries, getting the sensor up and running takes seconds. I mean, for this, I just took one of our existing example codes, switched the output from serial monitor to OLED, and just like that, I've got a really tight digital compass. And if I had spent more than 30 seconds rewriting this, this could easily be a compass dial instead of a numeric output. And aside from digital compass and navigation, the sensor is also great for position sensing and general purpose magnetic field measurements. So check out our new quick micro form factor with our new quick micro magnetometer. Pick up yours over at sparkfun.com. And of course, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. This looks ridiculous with just this on the table. Sure does. The new SparkFun Micro Magnetometer. That's all. That's all it's called. I'm not saying with the MMC58-5983. I mean, I just changed the out... Uh, I want to say... Really well. Micro Magnetometer. I feel like it may have been a little fast. PQRSTUVWXYZ. <laughs> For positioning sensing... Positioning? <laughs> SparkFun Micro Magnetometer. That's it. It's the easiest one I say all day. 31 videos to shoot today. This is the easiest one to say. <laughs>